Hey guys, it's Ness. Ness of each tripping. Oh my gosh, today is July the 21st, 2020. Guys, let me tell you, it's been crazy. This cra this month has been crazy. Month of July has been crazy for me. Um, I was just checking in, you guys, because I had a few events that happened to me that I wanted to talk to you guys about. Um, so basically, um, my updates are, you know, the kids are fine. We're fine. Um, everything. We're staying COVID-free, COVID-19 free. Um, I wanted to do something special for the kids because they don't really get to go anywhere. I work a lot. Their father work a lot. I travel more with the kids than he would, but it's kind of like, you know, because I like to go different places a lot. So it's that's what the difference is. But guys, like, man. So we went to the kids and I went to Wilmington, North Carolina, to uh, basically we stayed at the was it Fairfield by Marriott, which is a very good hotel. I do recommend that hotel. Um, we booked that hotel. We stayed there. I mean, Kiara had a ball. Joshua had a ball. Like, Kiara wanted to go to the pool. Then after the pool, she showered and went straight to the ocean. Like, <laughs> so it's so different in Wilmington. Like, um, you have, it's very different than Myrtle. We, we, we've only been going to Myrtle over the years. But Wilmington is different because you have to park on a strip. And then you have to walk to the beach. You just don't have parking it in the beach. So it's like a strip right there along where they have the boat docks and all that stuff. It, it was beautiful, guys. It was really beautiful. Um, and we spent the rest of the evening, you know, on the beach. We ate our dinner before we got there um, and stuff. But then we went back to the hotel. And then we got up the next morning, checked out, went to, what is it, the USS North Carolina Battleship. The Civil War battleship that was at, in the actual Civil War. So we were able to tour that, get some pictures and all that stuff. It was fun. And it was a fun little quick getaway. Um, it wasn't expensive at all. Like, you have to really know how to travel, get your discounts and all that stuff <laughs> and everything. But I really enjoyed it. The kids enjoyed it. Um, yeah, so basically, guys... Um, I have a trip coming up this weekend with me and my family. Um, the kids, no kids are going. Adults only. We're going to Miami. Y'all hear that song by Will Smith? Okay. <laughs> but, guys, like, for real, like, Miami is going to be so much fun. I've never been. I've always wanted to go. Guys, you know my channel is Vanessa B. Trippin', so... I'm doing little trips here and there now. I'm I'm happy about it. We are staying COVID-19 free. We're gonna wear our masks. Um, we're gonna wash our hands, sanitize, Lysol, everything. Um, my family and I we're gonna have like an Airbnb there. Um, and we fly out on Friday morning, like 7:40. The flight and it's gonna be from 7:40 to 9:40. Um, we'll be there that morning. Like, this is going to be an experience for me all over again. I have not been on a plane since 2004 or five, But that's been a long time, okay? And back then, I was freaking out, okay, over riding on a plane. But I'm excited. Um, I can't tell you how much, like, anticipation I have. Like, I, I really enjoy my family. We're real close-knit. And... I'm excited about this experience. Um, we're celebrating also um, my cousin's birthday, Emmanuel. Um, but I do plan on doing some um, vlogging there too, of course. It's Miami. Why not vlog? But I am so excited about everything. I, I'm i going to leave my babies behind. But mommy need to vacate sometimes on her own too. It's okay. And women, I just also want to talk to you guys about that too. Like it's okay to... Mommy moment. Okay, can you tell Kiara, please? Thank you. But it's okay to vacay. Okay? Go get yourself, get get your hair done, your nails done, which all that's going to be done by Thursday. But get your hair done, your nails done. You know, get nice. Get glammed up. Feel beautiful about yourself inside and out, you know. 
Um, do what you have to do to have fun. Being as COVID-19, be safe though, okay? You can be cute, you can have your little mask on, matching your outfit. It's okay, it's a part of the new fashion now, okay? So that's my whole thing, you know. Um, get your hair done, your nails done. Um, listen to some music, get your playlist ready. You know, I'm going to do a thing about that, too, about what I want to have on my playlist. Um, but I just want, you know, for the plane and stuff. Like that's what I'm going to have my playlist. But, you guys, just like I always say, self-love, self-care, you know, that's just how I do. Um, it took me a long time to learn how to do that, how to self-love myself. Because I was always being a mom, always... At the time when I was married, being a wife, I was never taking time out to do stuff that I really wanted to do. And I'm not saying, guys, oh, go get a divorce and then you can find yourself. No, just don't lose yourself. You have your one body. You have your mind. You have things that you like, what you dislike. And you need to be yourself at all times. Don't lose yourself, okay? Um, guys, um, I mean, right now, I'm just chilling with life and... I'm just really trying to be just, I'm trying to live a good life, okay? I'm not going to say I'm trying to live my best life. I'm not trying to say all that. I'm just really trying to have a good life. Um, You know, like, guys, my my father, he's doing well. Um, He's lived a long life, okay? I'm not going to disclose his age. He wouldn't want that. But I will tell you that he has seen a lot of things, a lot of decades, a lot of people coming, going, all that stuff. So I want to live the same life. Um, I just want to be able to be careful and aware. And guys, be aware, even though you're in a group, um, we will be in a group uh, of people, be aware of your surroundings. Don't just be like, oh, I'm doing this and not aware. Um, I will say, you know, if you are, if you're doing something um, or whatever, let people know what you're doing. Let people know where you are going, okay? Um, that's like my trip, my whole tip on tripping. Um, you know, as far as, you know, if you're going to trip out while out, make sure somebody know that what you're doing, okay, and where you are. Um, you know, because you just can ne you never can tell nowadays, and people want you to trust them just like that. <laughs> no don't especially you going somewhere you know make sure you have people who are together with you that's all i ask but i'm excited guys i'm super excited um like i am gonna be in miami two more days on friday and we're not coming back until that tuesday so the, the, yeah so we'll be there for friday saturday sunday monday tuesday five days five days I have not been on a vacation. And guys, you know, I love my job. I love the kids that I have, the students that I have. But I'm like, I need to breathe. <laughs> I really need to breathe. Um, on another, on a, on a note of not traveling, um, yesterday, myself and my children, Kiara and Joshua, we were involved in an, a car accident. Um, the lady in front of us, we were going 30, 35 miles per hour. And she was like, basically like, came like something came out like a car came out in front of her and then another car was going in so they were doing this in front of her and she had to slam and i had to go right in the back of her no brakes at all so guys it's just my car is not total only cosmetic damage thank you god and I really thank God for that because my car, I can still drive it. It might be kind of mangled in the front just a little bit, but it's not like that. And you really can't tell unless you really get up on it. I mean, you have to be like this to really see it. Okay. <laughs> but I thank God. And guys, like I always say, be thankful for everything. Okay. Um, Kiara's neck and her back kind of hurt a little bit. But what I would tell you guys, be thankful for every single thing. Be thankful for everything that you have um and that you do yeah so basically guys um you know like i always thank god for everything i know a lot of people out there don't believe in him but i'm telling you like you have to thank god for every little small thing to big thing things you can't see things you can't see you have to thank him in advance because for real it could have been a whole different story yesterday it could have been a whole lot worse um everything could have just 
been so turned around. But we walked away. We were able to um, walk, talk, breathe. The car, I can drive it still. Like, I'm so thankful. I'm super thankful to God for that. For You, know, you just don't know. Um, I, I'm just so thankful. So th very thankful. Because cars you can replace, but people you cannot. Um, you only have, like I always say, you only have one body. So, guys, with that being said, like, I, I, I honestly... Like last night, I just felt it, and I said, "Okay, God, I'm gonna take time out for you." And I took both of my kids, I held them by their hands, and we prayed and we thanked God. Um, even though the accident happened, we're we're fine. We're okay, and that's the biggest thing. We're okay. You know, we're fine. Um, it's nothing that we have to leave the hospital for. None of that stuff. You know, I mean, it's a lot a lot to be thankful for and so yeah so whoever's watching this you know or who may run across my video or whatever you know I just encourage you to please turn your life over to God to Jesus Christ because he is seriously the most incredible incredible choice you can make in your life to have in your life okay um you know just know who he is just you know just Follow him. Allow him. All you have to do is say, God, I'm ready. Whatever you want me to do, I'm, I'm on board with you. And I'm ready for you to just guide me through my life. And he will. Like, he really will. And he will show up and, like they always say, show up and show out. He really will. Like, you'll be looking up at the sky like, okay, God, I know that was you. You know? So, guys, I just wanted to just come in and just check um, in with you guys and just say Hi and everything like that and i'm so happy and i'm excited about my trip this week um guys i just uh keep everyone in prayer i keep me in prayer as we go safe travels and everything like that and i know that god is with us and just please be safe continue to be safe wear your gloves wear your face mask sanitize hand sanitizer use that wash your hands when you get home with you know what is it 20 26 seconds wash your hands wash your face get just get yourself in the shower like i said keep yourself clean <laughs> you know um like seriously guys we can do this we can get through this COVID 19 we can do it just don't be crazy about it and throw your mask on the ground mm -hmm. that's some people out there y'all it's nasty throw a mask on the ground gloves on the ground don't you know a kid can come pick that up or just somebody just that's nasty pick it up mm. Mm. nasty but anywho guys just keep being clean okay just try your best to all right but guys i love you guys thank you so much please subscribe to vanessa be tripping um like this video please give me a thumbs up and i just want to uh, just continue to be Everyone, continue to be humble, stay blessed, and never stressed. And that's my thing, okay? I love you guys. Bye.